It's so hard to believe that, yes, we are under a first alert action day in anticipation of this snow showing up tomorrow and highs around 30 degrees. A huge change from what we're experiencing today. Highs in the 60s and 70s. And as we go through the rest of this evening, it'll actually be pretty quiet, even up until about 11 o'clock tonight with a temperature of 52 degrees. Now, after midnight, we start to see some rain rolling in, and that rain will change to snow here for the Denver area. And then we just see, keep seeing that snow falling here for our region. As for our first alert, Boulder camera, sponsored by Tebow Properties here on the mall. You can see not a lot of people out, but boy, those temperatures are nice in the 60s and 70s. We'll have rain after midnight tonight, snow and cold on Sunday. And we could see about three to six inches of snow in Denver as this storm moves on through. Right now, though, 60s and 70s. We're at 74 in Denver, 70 in Commerce City, and 66 for Highlands Ranch. If you're in Parker, 68 degrees right now for you, and then 58 up in Georgetown. Also, with this cold front coming our way, the winds have been picking up a little bit more, so we'll, it'll be breezy in through tonight. We also have winter weather advisories and everything shaded in blue for our northern and central mountains. A freeze watch out toward Grand Junction, but we're expecting about five to eight inches of snow from late tonight into Monday morning here just off to our west. And that does include our western suburbs from Boulder to Golden into Evergreen and Conifer. So keep that in mind, especially if you, you live in those areas, you're gonna be dealing with a little bit more snowfall. And look at all these watches and warnings stretching from Montana into the Central Plains, even up toward Chicago and the Great Lakes with this very powerful cold front affecting so much of the U.S. Tonight, though, it looks pretty quiet, even in through about 8.30 this evening. Once we get closer to midnight, you can see the snow starting to encroach on the area. Once we get toward 5 in the morning tomorrow, we'll see those temperatures drop. We'll be in the 20s for overnight lows with that rain changing over to snow and those temperatures really dropping in the 20s for tonight teens and 20s for the mountains and 40s for the western slope. So that cold front is going to mean everything with how cold it gets and how early the snow shows up. But our high tomorrow, only 30 degrees. It'll be snowy and colder. We'll have temperatures only in the 30s here for the Front Range and the Plains. Same up in the mountains. Still in the 50s, though, for the western slope. And we'll have 40 in Telluride and 52 in Durango. This is what it looks like for the snowfall forecast all the way through Monday evening. So we're expecting a couple of inches here into tomorrow. And we could see about three to six inches, as I mentioned, here in the Denver area. The closer you are to the foothills, the heavier the amounts will be especially up toward Allens Park, Netherland, and into Winter Park. Our Sunday forecast showing the snowfall sticking with us through much of the day. And then as we head into Monday, the snow is still here. So a couple of inches on Monday is possible as well. Our seven-day forecast, first alert action days in through tomorrow and Monday. Highs only in the 30s. Come out of it a little bit more on Tuesday and Wednesday. Highs in the 40s, but a chance for rain and snow midweek. Then we'll be back in the 50s by the time we get to Friday. 58 degrees by Saturday this next weekend with uh, partly cloudy skies.